TV Princess back at SeaWorld. Finally, I know it's been a long time since I've seen you. Well, no, seen you every day, but I'm finally back here for Vanilla Ice. Yes, I am old, remember, and remember him from a long time ago. Did some home remodeling in the interim. Kind of weird, interesting career. I am a little bit late, so I have about 20 minutes to try and get to the theater. I don't think I'll make it. Uh, had some issues charging on the way, cost a lot of time, but it's fine, it's in the past, and uh, we're going to enjoy the show. So, gotta head into the park now, and to see how far I get. And of course, I just walked into the park. I actually just walked through the mag, and they made the announcement that the uh, concert has reached capacity. So, I will be enjoying Mr. Ice from the bridge again, which wasn't so bad, and at least that lets me move around, because I think once you're in there, you don't want to leave. But the good part is, I am hungry, and the food festival is still going on, and I did not forget my lanyard this time. It's been a couple weeks, so this is the first time I'm seeing the uh, entry lagoon partially drained, although there's water rushing in, maybe but well, they can't be done because they're still scaffolding on the lighthouse, which is getting a new paint job. I was not able to find a spot at the Chargers, so I think we're going to invoke Plan B a little bit later. And more compliments to SeaWorld for leading the way in all of this. Magic Kingdom still has not opened the Main Street ice cream shop, but Edie's is now available here. It's been open for a week. First time I'm seeing it. So, options. It looks fun, but this is an overcomplicated novelty. Uh, the drink is a puff and punch. It's a vodka with watermelon, and it is served in this little pouch thing. And they uh, do give you a straw, but I was expecting more of a uh, Capri Sun type thing with a little flap or something, but there's just these holes on the top here that I guess you're supposed to put the straw through, but the straw is not long enough and it falls into the drink, which makes this, again, uh, or as I said, way more complicated than it needs to be, but we are, we're gonna, we're gonna get through this, we are gonna persevere, we are going to figure it out first. All right, being the expert in adult beverages that I am, shut up, I think I figured it out, well, at least I figured out a way for it to work, if you uh, basically close the little, I guess, Ziploc, like this, the straw doesn't fall in. And I guess it's uh, drinkable now. Way, way too complicated. It took me a whole eight seconds to sort of sort this out. Here we have a, a spoon bill. Not sure exactly which kind, but you can see uh, its beak is round and flat at the front. That's why they call it a spoon bill. Haven't seen one of those. Here, not even at SeaWorld, not even here in Florida. I'm gonna have to look this up. This is actually quite a treat. So, uh, you know what? This is worth uh, missing a few bars of vanilla for. A uh, bird friend. First, avoid the windmills, they'll kill you. And uh, the good food is across the lake. Yeah, not, not the twig, unless you're building a nest. I have my place here on the bridge, and this was almost a, a disaster because for the first five, ten minutes, they had switched over the music out here to the concert, so it was just the regular like Radio Sea World or whatever. So here I am enjoying my an overly complicated beverage while listening to uh, Vanilla Ice, and uh, we'll talk about that later. Interesting things. Bring back. A heck of a lot of memories, let me tell you something. You know, I, he, he does a song, and I have these weird flashbacks to maybe where I either last heard it, or where, where I heard it a lot. I don't, it's super weird, you know, and you're gonna have the same thing. It's, it's super fun to do this. Uh, one quick note, the straw here is edible. Uh, it's like some sugar stuff. Uh, sweet starch, probably, and uh, it's actually not that bad. It could be a confectionery item. So I guess uh, plus one for that. All right, well, I'm just gonna 
hang out here and enjoy the rest of the show, which I guess you can hear. Oh, by the way, uh, let me tell you, if you're worried, yes, the value for these is really good. Quick update. The edible straw is actually pretty good. It reminds me of something that feels very familiar, but I cannot quite place it. Something from a long, long time ago. We're talking like 40 years ago. And I'm trying to remember. It's something like I got at one of the trucks, the ice cream trucks or whatever that would pass by the elementary school. But I'm gonna up it to a plus two just for the edible straw. Actually, this is really good. And the drink was actually really good too. So I actually would recommend. It was the uh, penguin, no, not penguin punch. It was a penguin punch. Whatever I said earlier, that's what it was. But it was good. Well, it is a bit dark, but this is the best I could do. This is the lobster mac and cheese, or a lobster seven mac and cheese, or something like that, from the American market. There's music in the back room, so I had to keep talking. And I am hungry. I said that earlier, and I realized I hadn't eaten. Vanilla Ice just finished, and fortunately, I found a place at a charger, and I just need to stop rambling because I am very hungry and just eat. It looks really good. I hope it is. And to top off the evening, this is an Ivanhoe Park Guavacation, another fruit-flavored beer, which sounded delicious, and it actually is. It is a little more fruity than uh, most beers would be, a little uh, bit like the... Well, you know what? I'm not going to say it because that's kind of insulting. And this is much better than that. It is quite tasty and it is definitely guava. So I'm going to enjoy this uh, for the next, um, well, I don't know. I got a wow while she charges. So I'll be here. So far, it is a super fun, oddly, even though I haven't done much evening here at SeaWorld. Vanilla Ice was actually, that's why it was fun. Uh, just, I don't know bringing back all those memories. Uh, the park is not empty by any stretch. So there's uh, another midway right over there, which is uh, eh, a little bit more busy. I am uh, still enjoying my last treat and we'll be getting dessert soon. After I walk around the park one more time, I am oddly low on steps, but that's only because I, I stood on the bridge for quite a while for the concert. Uh, kind of stupid because you could see the stadium was it didn't look like he was even half full but whatever all the nonsense going on anyway there's really I guess no lesson today other than I realized vanilla ice um oddly I love that that is his performance name or his stage name it is such an incredible troll and way back when it was fine Nobody cared. It was cute. It was interesting. It was fun. If you look at him, it makes perfect sense. Although, if a new artist today tried this, oh my god, it would be crazy. But that's kind of an example of how things have gotten just so much worse and weird and dumb. Yes, Vanilla Ice. It is perfect. It fits. Nobody cares. Nobody reads anything weird into it. We had a lot of fun listening to him back in the day. Had a lot of fun listening to him tonight. So, you know what? I am okay with that. So, I would say just let the troll continue. And if they realize it and are triggered, it's going to be fun to watch the meltdown. Anyway, got to get those steps in because I said I'm low. And I already said that. So... I will see you with dessert, which I hope I have. If I don't, I'm sorry. Oh, that's still a thing? And finally, for dessert, we have the Dulce de Leche empanadas. There's four of them right there, and they are a little bit smaller, look more like pot stickers, but uh, that's okay because they sound quite delicious, and this will be the next to last item from the Caribbean market. Still have to try that slider, and I'm expecting good things because the last two things, the conch fritters and the Jamaican beef patty, were spectacular. So let's see how this one stands up. The Dulce de Leche empanadas, really good, really good. The empanada itself is, is nice and crispy. Uh, it's served warm, which is really good. The caramel sauce is a commodity item, so 
Yeah, let's just be aware of that. But the empanada itself is pretty good. Uh, this is definitely a shareable item. It is the perfect buffet dessert. Something that you would take one just to try and really enjoy. But uh, four of them is a bit much just because it gets kind of repetitive. So I, I would have enjoyed one, had a second one, but that would be it in a normal circumstance. So if you do get this, make sure you have a friend to share it with like I don't have, and that is very depressing, but it's still good and I still had fun. So I really enjoyed it. It is a buy, but with a friend. Okay, enough of that. Okay. It is about time to head out. The park is about to close, and Miss Liberty 2 just finished charging, so I'm going to go and uh, pick her up and uh, get some rest tomorrow. Not necessarily a big day. I do have some provisioning to do, and it will be my first visit to the Epcot Flower and Garden Festival. Yes, yeah, so that's going to be super exciting, and I'm going to pick up something extra special, which you will see pretty soon. All right, gonna finish these and uh, head out. Not a marathon night, but did get one ride on Mako. Always fun. Well, princess, it's happening. But for now, it is finally a emptying sea world. The park's about to close in a few minutes. Had a great day. Wasn't here that long, or maybe I was a few hours. But it was like more fun than really that amount of time would let you to believe. Anyway, I had a great time. I had some great food and rode a great ride and just had a great time uh, listening to Vanilla Ice. That was super awesome. And it totally made up for the, I don't know, the, the drama of before issues I had while charging Miss Liberty 2 on the way up. That cost me a little bit of time. A little bit frustrating but I did get it worked out you know to charge my electric car but that is why I am thankful for my problems. Mm -hmm.